Hey guys, so yesterday we integrated Sentry into our application and uh, now Sentry is working. We are actually getting metrics and errors whenever something happens, so uh, which is good. An integration of Sentry was super easy, but I think I need to explore more to actually get the best out of Sentry, but I think right now it's uh, it's more than enough what we have. So <clears throat> that was all about Sentry. Uh, now what I want to do is check out some issues. So if I go to say card view, no, mood board view. <clears throat> so this is in the mood board view. And if I go to the image, it says width of uh, 1200, height of 630. And because of this width and height, if you can see the the size of the image is so big, which is not needed at all. I don't need any image that is that big. So I shouldn't have the image size itself, but I need to find a way to have the size of the figure. So I'm going to do some experimenting stuff but I know that this solution is not right so this is the image height and width what I'm going to do is I'm going to minus this by 200 whatever height we have minus by 200 width minus by 200 and now let's see if anything happens so now it's uh, a thousand by 430 I think if I refresh now it would work. There we go. Now its size is still thousand two hundred by six thirty. Okay, I need to basically see what get an understanding of what is source set. Source set is an HTML image attribute that specifies list of images in different browser situations. Okay. What does that mean? Just a minute. Okay. <clears throat> I presume complicated, but there are several ways to set it, but let's take a look at real example. Okay, okay. Here the source set tells the browser to load. If the viewport width is less than 600 okay <laughs> Those are a little larger image so this entire thing is the source set then you have this and then you have this oh right so this is the source set right here this is the <clears throat> size of the 
image. So now we're basically saying that if the image is based on the size, it will either render this or this. Alternately, you can set the pixel density. Same thing. Why source is important in SEO? So when, when because other browsers to load the optimal image size based on the best characteristics, larger images will have larger prices. There's no point of loading an example. Small set. Yep, that's right. Which is correct. So now, if you see my source set right here. <clears throat> So I have a uh, entire thing and I do have, so if you can see, it says, it says over here, if it's one X, then width is 1024. If it's two X, then with this this and if it's oh that's it the you only have one x and two uh, x right so if I remove this. Now it's uh two X is more <coughs> which uh, I don't need at all. I need it to be small. So let's go and see next JS source set. Sizes. Okay, the size property serves two important purposes related to the image performance. The first value of size is used to determine which size of image to download from next image on image and resources. Uh, when the board is chooses, it does not get no size of image on the page. It selects an image in the same size or larger than the viewport. Sizes. New automated generator source set value. If the size is value is small, source set is generator suitable for a fixed and large source is generator suitable for responsive images. If you know your style and close image people with mobile. Okay. Okay, that's cool, but Okay, right now the size is uh... 362 292 so if I do this like 362 and then 292 refresh this yep so now the image size is much less it's much less it's just for 1x is 384 which is right and for 2x is this one and also i don't find any difference in quality 
but if I go to change this cover size, yep, bigger cover size, I can see a drop in the quality. But I think it's all right, it's not that bad. If I put this as 50 and 50, now there's a change in quality. So maybe I can put this as like 200 and uh, 200. Yep, I think that is also decent size. Of course, when you go big, the quality is reduced, but I think it's, uh, it's not that bad. The list, card, headlines. Okay, cool. Now what I want to do is there was an issue where the app was slow. I'm going to log into another account where there are a lot of images and check if this actually solves the issue. So this is the other account where I have tons of images. Now, whenever I select this, there was a delay. Okay, so that is not the issue. The delay is uh, still present. If I have height of 10 and width of 10, does it cause any difference? Uh, so that doesn't have anything to do with the selecting thing. It's just uh, just the uh, what do you call the downloading of the image is much more optimized. But the this there's, there's still a small like one second delay whenever I it's not instantaneous whenever I select something. But it is instantaneous, uh, but it's only not instantaneous when the size of the list is huge, like this when you have 80. But over here in my test account, it will be super instantaneous. So that I know is an issue with the drop zone container that I have, where you can like drop stuff and it uploads, but it's not nothing to do with the size of the image. So, yep, we'll figure that out maybe in another stream. But this stream, we just saw what source sets are, and then, uh, yep, we optimized our image for better source set. So, that's it for this stream, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.